So the general question is around the details surrounding the re-entry into Lahaina slash Maui. Thank you, Jennifer. Uh, so the, the re-entry period begins on Monday. Uh, this is mostly driven by the uh, county. And I had a great conversation with Chief Oliveira, I still call him Chief, um, who is uh, the, the MEMA director now. They're going to be as flexible as they can with people. They anticipate some people will only want to go for a very short period of time, a few minutes, um, to say goodbye in a way to their property. Others may want to stay several hours. They're going to be very accommodating. They will be providing a lot of protective gear, and they're also going to be mindful of the environment at the time. For example, if winds are very heavy or high and there's anything moving, uh, moving the ash around, they're going to be more careful. Uh, they're going to uh, go methodically through a very large number of uh, quadrants or zones. And I would actually def um, uh, defer to them for any more details than that. I think it's going to take several weeks uh, at least for them to get through. Given the uh, pace at which the EPA has gone through the properties, probably all will be cleared uh, in a, sh a few short weeks, actually, for that phase. Uh, they anticipated it was going to be three months total. Uh, to get through uh, to a safe space. There's going to be, like I said earlier, some behavioral health support uh, furnished by the state. Uh, we know that people will be grieving and suffering um, a great deal of despair when they see uh, how little is left. Also, there are some locations where people did lose loved ones, as we know. So all of those are considerations, but they intend to do what's ever necessary for people to get closure. Follow-up, or are you good? I, I don't know that there'll be a formal time limit. There will definitely be capacity for several hours for people to uh, go through. In a discussion last week, they did talk about having some support from county personnel professionals to help help people sift through some of the ash. Uh, so there will be support there in general. I think some people will need to take several hours uh, to to um, have this first visit. This doesn't mean this will be the last time either, of course, that people will get to get back to their properties. It's still their property, uh, but it will then go into the next phase, which is the larger removal of debris, which by the way, uh, when the Army Corps of Engineers does, they're going to stage that debris still in Hawaii for a significant amount of time so it doesn't go immediately to the mainland. Uh, so there'll be lots of opportunities for people to see if they find a lost ring or a picture. Um, some other keepsake. Okay. 